Hey guys, welcome back to Magic Arena. I am Seifer Cat. Today we're doing some sealed guilds of Ravnica. I was originally going to draft and wait for a few days, but I thought, you know what? Let's do some more sealed. I really want more Ravnica packs, and you know what's the best way to do them? Getting those sweet, sweet gems in together. So it all comes down to the rares. Oh, may the gods of random number generators smile upon me this day. I see every color in the rainbow! That's bad. Uh, Mnemonic Betrayal. Look, I feel a Mnemonic Betrayal right now. Don't you worry. Okay, let's look at my rares first off, because this changes everything. Doom Whisperer? Eh, not a bad card, actually. It could have some use. Flying Trample, 6-6 six, six for 5. It's pretty good. As a vanilla thing, pretty good. Runaway Steamkin, when you cast a red spell, it puts counters on it and then it lets the steam out in the form of red mana. Meh. Uh, Amara, Soul the Accord, not bad. Uh, not fantastic. Citywide Bust. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, sure. Nacromoeba. Nacromoeba? Like, uh, like a sleeping amoeba. I don't know why I got stuck on that. When it dies... Oh wait, when it's put into your graveyard from your library you put in the battlefield. Well that's not useful right now. And you might betray out exile all cards from your opponent's graveyard. You may cast them this turn. And then return them. So for a turn you get to cast all these spells. And not a limited card, I can certainly see it being useful later. But let's just look at our rares and mythics again. Thank you for clicking the wrong button. So, rares that are no good. That one's no good. That one's not really any good. That one's no good. Green, white, maybe black. Even that's not particularly great. My rares are not going to be the ones that carry me this day, it seems. Okay. Let's have a look. Let's go through our pulls. Shall we start with white? Let's start with white. Actually, let's start with multicolored. Uh, so, Blue Black's actually looking pretty good. Demir Spybug, Thought Erasure, Disinformation Campaign. Draw it, look, make them all scatter the cards. Mnemonic Betrayal, I mean. Geez, that's a mythic? Gosh. Whisper Agent, pretty good. Arc will take down, good removal. Night Vale Predator. Welcome to Night Vale Predator. Oh no. You don't want to have a Welcome to Night Vale Predator. Okay, so Demir's looking alright. Uh, is it? Is it? Um, I mean, guild mages. I'm not that thrilled with the guild mages these days. He can bolt deals damage to target creature equal to the number of instant sorceries. Okay, so let me do a creature though. Uh, lock it. Yeah. Hypno sizzle. Hypo sizzle. Hypothesizzle. Oh, you know what? I've seen that word so many times and now I've actually said it. Hypothesizzle is a very good name. Doesn't really excite me though. Um, in Golgari, we see three commons. Nothing particularly sings to me. In Boros, that's decent, I guess. Decent, decent. Decent, 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 decent. Okay, Boros is not bad. I mean, it's okay. Celestia, let's be honest, Celestia is where it's at right now for me. Um, Celestia is looking good. So, how do we feel about our individual colors? Demotion? It, Demotion, I feel, is a trap. It makes you think it's good, but it can't block. It can still attack. I always think it's like Luminous Bonds. You know, can't attack or block. Let's just say block. They're not great. Uh, good for battle. Sure, it's a very Celestia card if I've ever seen one. Healer's Hawk, always amazing. Hunted Witness. Sure. Take heart. Yeah. Citywide bust, sure, why not? Luminous bonds, good removal, sworn companions. I mean that's really just the vampire card that was in Exilon, except now it's soldiers with lifelink. I don't know why they have lifelink. All the culprit, destroy a big guy. It's just a big it's just a small citywide bust. For more. Oh, but it's instant, I guess. That's weird. Why is there more mana? Just because it's instant? 
Huh. Uh, blue. Blue... I mean, we could have something with Demir. So blue is an option. Makes myself... You know, I'm not caring about that. It's a 1-1 one, one flying for 2 mana. I mean, pff, maybe. I always wonder if I'd, I'd love to go Azorius. <laughs> but sadly, that's not an option. And a crab. I mean, it's a crab. Blue doesn't excite me. Black... I mean, black's okay. I mean, blue-black wasn't my option. I could go blue-black and then throw some... else in there. We got some destruction. We got a Doom Whisperer. Hey, uh... I mean, look, I was saying Demir looks pretty good. Demir maybe splashing red might not be the worst day. There's some good red stuff. Green, disappointing color. Which really pushes me away from the Celestia thing. Whereas going Demir with red? So that's going to Demir, is it? Let's see what that looks like. Uh, Demir, is it? Demir, is it? Oh, but look at all these green and white cards. Ugh. I mean, there's some solid things in there, but... Let's just see what happens when we put Demir and Izzet together. Um, where are my Demir cards? Surveil. Good. I don't know about that. We may come back for that. Two of those guys. Our take down very good. Welcome to Night Vale. Decent. Uh, anything Demir that I might want? I mean, sorry, is it? Yeah, sure. Uh... Sure, and take that. Then we take the pity full. Pity, pity list, not pity full. Oh, geez, that is how you get Gorgons to hate you. Okay, then we go into blue. Uh, blue, which I don't know if I saw anything that was too exciting. Although, I've got a couple of things that are good with Surveil, so maybe. Am I actually using any of my rares? Oh, yeah, I'm using one of them. This has not been a great seal pull. I'll pull. I'll be honest with you. Uh, a crab, vicious rumors. Probably not. Have night. Yo, oh, I'll take them. Doesn't mean I'll keep them. Never happened. Sure, maybe. I'm really just taking things that could be useful, but I honestly have no idea at this stage. Uh, Brazilian bats. I know it's not what I said, but I'm going to pretend it did. Um, Runaway Steamkin's probably not that exciting. That is pretty good. Gravitic Punch. We've played that game before. You know what? It was pretty funny the first time. Let's take it for the second. Barging Sergeant, always good. Okay, well... We're in a decent number of cards, I guess. Oh god, our three cost slot is ridiculous. if I had enough great ways things but not really I mean do I even possibly go four color getting that white why would I do that what would I do that for luminous bonds one copy of a healer's hawk no you know what let's stay the colors we're at now three color is where things are a bit ridiculous I mean three not three color three mana one mana we've got nothing going on that's okay Crate maker, you know what? Crate maker, not crate maker, crater maker. Crater maker could be good. I don't know about this runaway steamkin. And it's a 1 1, and I don't really have that many red spells. Pass. Lead guild mage, you know what? Sure. 
at Gateway Plaza. Okay, so we've got a bunch of lands. Now we've got to think about ditching nine cards from this, which always hurts a bit. Um, I wish it actually told me how many percentage of mana symbols it has, but let's see. Three costs, three costs. Why do we not want a three cost? Draw a card, discard a card every time I surveil, draw another card. I mean, that's, you know, that's okay. Um, you know, we'll take one of those and get rid of the one of the crabs. I really want that spy bug to do well, but I don't know if it will. Never happened. Yeah. We're one of the Veiled Shades, I don't know if we need two of them. Whisper Agents, they're amazing, we keep them. Beacon Bolt, how many instants and sorceries do I even have? One, two, three, don't count itself, four, five, six, seven, even? And it jump starts. Yeah, right. You know what? That might be good. Graphic punch, I just kind of want to keep because it was kind of amazing last time, but I feel like that was a different deck. Doom Whisper and Deadly Visit, we're keeping those. Hypothesis, -ism. keeping that. I mean, drawing two cards and then doing damage to a creature, that's never going to be a sad time. Yeah, not so sure about that shade. All creatures get minus one, minus one to end turn. It'll be good if we encounter some sort of Celestia bullshit. That's all adept. A few ways of just avoiding damage, don't we? Got a lot of ways of drawing cards as well. Uh, you know what these bats? These bats are just going to die instantly, so let's not keep those bats. Um, Cosmotronic Wave is good. How do you score? Can I keep looking at it? But I mean, it's two two with Death Touch. Not bad. The death touch is really the reason I'm keeping her on. You know, let's get rid of these vapors. I don't actually think they're that helpful. So we've got an interesting curve here. Turn one, we never have anything. Turn two, we may have some creatures. Oh, cool. I didn't know you could mouse over things and find out what they are. That's cool. You can't, oh, you can't, oh, oh, look at that. Oh, wow, it tells you the types. Well, today I learned. Really cool. So I didn't even need to count them. I could just mouse over it. This is not a tribal deck. I can tell you that right now. All right. Average cost three, little always a little on the high side. Do I want to do anything else? Let's have one final look before we call it quits. I think we're good. This is our deck, and the most important thing is, of course. Choosing the icon, which should, of course, be the Doom Whisperer, because he is my rare that I am using. I think I'm only using one rare in this deck, which is not good. Anyway, guys, let us do the okay. game. I immediately got conscious about my mana. Yeah, okay, sure. 
So this is we've got what we've got to work with. Worst case situation, we get three packs, two hundred gems. Okay, so what we really want to do is we want to achieve three wins. If we can achieve three wins, then we're happy. And is this the hand that's going to give us the first win? Any of the other three wins is just golden. Um, okay with this. Nothing until turn three, unfortunately, but that's okay. I will keep this hand. And the guild gate, because I have no reason not to play the guild gate. Because I can't ever play anything on turn one anyway. Turn two, there's never a play on turn two either. Well, sometimes there's a play on turn two, but not this turn. A Legion Guild Mage. Well, how do you do? Uh, what's he going to do to me? Not much, really. Could tap someone down, I suppose. You know what? Let's protect myself a little bit. Uh, do I need another mountain? Probably not. Pitif pitiless Gorgon, not a pitiful Gorgon. Uh, she'll do fine next turn, I guess. Can't play her, because she's double black. I didn't consider that, actually. Yep. She's trying, but she's not what I want. So, my opponent so far has only revealed Boros colours. Maybe looking at is yet. I don't know why I always say is yet, but it's more fun to say is yet than is yet. Uh, okay, well, I think the real plan here is to play the island and the spinal centipede. Gosh, what a horrific name! Oh, I see. It's adorned itself with a spine. Okay, so it's wearing someone's spine. You. Not really a spine so much as a rib cage. That's kind of a terrifying cool design. I'm already not a fan of oh dear. Okay, that's a that's fine. We can deal with him. We're gonna hypno sizzle hypno sizzle him. Uh that's really our only answer here. Discard an online card. Yeah, we've got an online card we can discard. Gosh, only one though. Get rid of that. That can just go away, please. Uh, well, we did draw our swamp that we needed for our Doom Whisperer. So we'll be whispering all sorts of Doom in a moment. by me. Doom Whisperer, show me how quickly you can die. I feel like this thing might die so quick. Oh, that animation is ghastly. I like it. That's a fun animation. So, Doom Whisperer, what do you whisper about? Doom Whispers. Doom Whispers. I have a funny feeling he's about to be shot down. Or tapped. I mean, that's gonna happen, I guess. He's never gonna attack, is he, with that Legion Guild Mage out? Looks like we need to deal with that Legion Guild Mage. By shooting him. That also means he can't really spend four mana on something, so maybe that's okay. You know, take your wins where you can. Um, I lock it. Uh, kind of wish you would tap the mana differently there. I didn't really think about that. Okay, I am not expecting it to let me attack. No. Okay. So yeah, my Doom Whisperer is going to whisper Doom, but very quietly. He's just going to quietly tell you about the Doom. Meanwhile, I might attack with this guy. Did I attack with that guy? No, I shouldn't. Not yet. We are in a stalemate, unfortunately, friends. Uh, 
A torch courier. Okay. That is a card that does not particularly concern me. And we will play a Whisper Agent. See if we can get something good next turn. I would like something that does 2 damage to a Legion Guild Mage. That's not going to do 2 damage to a Legion Guild Mage. I think we all are glad you tried. Okay, that's not helping me either. So let's uh, do this in the wrong turn order. I really want something like that. That's exactly what we wanted. That's actually what we wanted. Cool. So I'm going to play him. The Crater Maker can deal with the Guild Mage and then we can... Yeah, let's just blow him out. Two damage, do the Legion Guild Mage. I expect you to use the stack to tap my Doom Whisperer down. Yep, there it goes. That's alright. Because now he needs to have another way to deal with uh, the Doom Whispering. We are, however, at 19 cards and he's at 26. So we've got a massive card advantage at the moment. That's cool. Um, and we're going to attack with the Spinal Centipede. We're going to start the attack attacks finally. It's finally happening. Look at that. Three damage. We are ahead. Each is not here at the moment to tell me, ask me if I'm ahead. Like, or we, what happened to the rest of me, which is... Eh, she'll be back soon. She's at work. Well, she's coming home now. Um, but yeah. I don't know why you needed an Easter update, but that's the Easter update currently. What are you playing? Now that you don't need to save your mana... You might play something. Uh, yeah, sure, whatever. I'm not too fussed by that. Sure. I mean, you can't use it. Because you haven't played an instant or a sorcery. You've played an instant or a sorcery. Well done. Okay, he's going to attack with that guy now, I imagine. Which is totally fine, I don't mind using the Demir Informant to stop that. Because it doesn't have haste, so... I'm not too fussed by this block. I mean, he spent a card and... Uh... Okay, Demir Spybug, here we go. At the moment, he's a cute little tiny bug, but he can become bigger when I decide it. When I just get tired of being a cute tiny bug, I can make him big. It's gonna cost me a lot of life though. Uh, so we're just gonna attack for six, because why not? What's he gonna do? I mean, I say what's he gonna do? If he's gonna do something, he'll show me. Okay, good whispering. Speak softly, carry a large doom whisperer. Is he going to do that again? Okay, you create two little one ones. That's cool. Uh, in theory, I could win this next turn. So he's going to kill one of these guys with the maximized velocity. I am okay with that because I really want my life total. Uh, to stay as high as it can right now. Oh. Not what I expected. Let's put it on the Demir spy bug. So now I got eight damage. I can do myself quite a bit of damage to change that. I don't care. I'm going to surveil first. Yep. 
If my opponent sees what he's um, doing, he'll be conceding about now, I imagine. Don't need that. Yep, he sees what I'm doing. Cool. I'm happy with that win. Let's see if I can get into bronze tier one. It's going to stop just before. Yep, it always does. Ah, that's fine.